Yes, meanwhile, the UMass basketball team enjoying their upset afterglow after the Minutemen shocked defending champs Kansas in front of 17,000 screaming Jayhawks fans yesterday and maybe putting a stop to their early season struggles in the process. Ricky Harris leading the way against Kansas with a team-high 18 points. Did so with a little style. Started the hoop after at first and then a sweet spin dribble drive and kiss off the glass for another two. Tony Gaffney, meanwhile, 13 boards, six block shots, showing why he's among the nation's leaders in both categories. Gaffney, the ultimate team player yesterday, led the Minuteman in every statistical category except for points and did so, as you may or may not know, on a bad ankle. Now, after the game, I had an exclusive opportunity to speak with the leader of the band, Coach Kellogg. My guys have had a good demeanor about them. They're coming to practice with a good attitude. And when you have a good bunch of kids that'll compete, that'll come to practice every day with a good attitude, um, you have a chance to surprise some people. And today was kind of a culmination of a good couple weeks of hard work. Um, you know, we haven't always been given the prize of a victory, but we've been given the prize of competing at the highest level. And, um, you know, hopefully our guys learn from this, that that's how you have to play every, every day, every night out. I think we can have a chance to have a pretty good season. Meanwhile, still to come with the Bernie's Valley Sports Replay, AG getting all A's with the UMass basketball team. We're going to spend a few minutes with the Minuteman known as the Agent. And more coming up, but first, the trivia, the Chicopee Savings Bank Trivia Challenge. Tonight's question, name the last time the UMass Minutemen defeated a defending national champion. Now, if you know, email me, sports at cbs 3 springfieldcom You're the first one with the right answer. You're going to win a gift certificate to JT's in downtown Springfield. Good luck. Good luck. Well, while the Kansas game may now be a memory, there's still no place like home for this Minuteman. After transferring to UMass and sitting out a season, guard Anthony Gurley starting to heat up for the Minutemen. CBS3 Springfield's Amy Lynn Stanley now with more on the man known as AG. Thanks, Jonathan. Call it home court advantage. Anthony Gurley back in the Bay State. And as he told me at the Mullen Center, the home cooking couldn't taste any sweeter. Hey, I'm Anthony Gurley, guard for the UMass Minutemen, being town's finest, and here's a few minutes with me. Anthony Gurley, also known as AG or Agent, is a redshirt sophomore guard who transferred from Wake Forest after his freshman year. A native of Massachusetts, Gurley became homesick after his freshman year and made his way back home where he became a Minuteman. I couldn't be happier just being back home playing in front of my hometown fans home, in the home state. My family comes out of games, my dad, my mom and like a bunch of my friends who are at the game. Anthony feels blessed to have the opportunity to play basketball at UMass as well as accomplish something that has never been done in his family. Be like first person in my family to graduate. That'll be, that'll really mean a lot to me. He is also thankful to be able to beat the odds of growing up in the inner city. Like a lot of kids don't really get the opportunity that I have to play college basketball, to go to college, it's a blessing. It's truly, truly blessed. Gurley fights hard for his UMass team on the court, but he also fights for another team, the Celtics, which often causes locker room and road trip arguments amongst players. Many teammates don't agree with his Boston boys' views. We got a lot of Boston haters on this team, so I got to let them know. We got a lot of Laker lovers. They don't agree with me, but I feel that Paul Pierce is the best player in the league, and they don't agree with me at all. Gurley lives his life and plays basketball by his motto, with no fear and no regrets, as inscribed on his forearms. Whatever you do, don't have any regrets at doing it. If you're on the court, just play your hardest every time. If you're doing anything, you know what I'm saying? Maybe if it's taking a risk, take your risk in life because you don't want to have any regrets. Anthony Gurley has no fear and no regrets. He feels one of the best decisions he has made in his life is coming back home and attending UMass. I'm really feeling happy to be here. Just happy to be back home Massachusetts weather the, just the whole feel I got when I came back it was great and of course you're home for UMass Hoops right here UMass Hoops Insider with Derek Kellogg airs each and every Saturday morning at 1130 only on CBS 3 Springfield your official home of UMass Athletics for the Bernie's Valley Sports Replay I'm Amy Lynn Stanley